Hello everybody, one and all, welcome back to Let's Play Morrowind, me Berex. And Karish, who is currently on an epic quest. Our first real expedition into the unknown is about to begin as we do this quest here. We're going to try and help Milin Faram, who's been attacked by House Lalu, in this place, which is west of the Shrine of Azura and south of the Old Dumma Ruins of this. So, um, he's marked the map there. But this isn't Karish's map. Um, Karish's map is here. So he'd have marked it about here. So we just have to go south from where we are. Because we can, we can, you know, Karish isn't daft. He knows that he's crossed the bay and we're on this sort of like. Here we go. Uh, you know, this, this is the same shape. So we have to go south. So that's what we'll do. We'll avoid the filthy mud crab. I'll actually uh, restore some magic now that I know I've got some of these. This is helpful. And I will. Um, let's heal. No, no, let's heal. It's a nice day, at least, to begin our uh, expedition. I'm wondering whether I should go along the coast? Or whether I should try and cross over the mountains. I'm probably going to go over the mountains. Uh, because we we know just from where the, the Dwemer have built their strongholds before that they build them on mountains rather than, you know, on the coast. Uh, so and it's our only real point of reference. So, see if we can uh, just get over here and already be attacked by... Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, well we can soul trap this. Um, I'm just gonna get. Let's go, let's go. Come, Bonnie. Behind you. Alright, kill it. You've got a dagger, really? That's like a short sword. Tanto or something. Bony. Bony. He even attacked me. Come on, there we That's more like it. <laughs> Just hit it once. Hit it once. My god. Wow. Oh, fine. Fine. Squishy. Should have got you in the first place, I guess. Please attack that before the spell runs out. It's only a worm. Hell, it's training our conjuration, but... Really? It can't be that tough. Is it blighted or something? I mean, I don't know. It better not be. So we captured... Yeah, Aquama Forager. Great. Uh, let's not walk this bit. It's beneath us. I said it was a nice day, didn't I? It looks like it's turning a bit overcast now. Stop following me. <laughs> and hopefully if, if we follow like along the top of the mountains, we should be able to see the, uh, you know, get a bird's eye view if you like, or you know, some such equivalent, and be able to see where this uh, Dwemer ruin is. The only thing is, will Karish resist going in it? I'm going to imagine yes, but on the way back, if he feels that he has enough resources, he will... Uh, oh, is that that is not a Dwemer ruin. Uh, it's in the way. We're going to go this around here. I'm not going to go there. We know what a Dwemer, Dwemer ruin looks like, and uh, that is not it. Although it is pretty neat looking. Haven't visited a Daedric Ruin yet with this character. Of course we will at some point. It is it is bound to happen. I'm just going to slow it down a little bit. It is bound to happen. Uh, at some point we're going to have to go in, into one of those but right now Karish is he's curious about it but it doesn't particularly look, you know, it looks pretty foreboding. It looks pretty scary. Um, and we're already uh, 
in danger of overexerting ourselves and our um, resources. So we'll just we'll just leave it for now. There will um, there may be a time uh, when Karish can just like do what he wants and not not have to rely so much on potions and everything. Maybe, maybe not. The only way I can see that happening really is if he gets like a restore magic of potion uh, item, like constant effect. And there's only one of those in the game as far as I know. Uh, and Trebonius has it. So how I can wangle that, I don't know. But maybe maybe mods add something or I can get one some other way. I don't know. What the hell is that? Well, I know what it is. It's a shalk or whatever. But Karish has never seen it before. Strange finding like a beetle on the top of a mountain. That's where we are. We are on the top of a mountain. Well, it seems pretty efficient because it avoids all the uh, Nyx hounds and Kagutis and stuff that are down there. So, I don't know. It seems like a pretty wise decision of Karish's this to uh, <clears throat> take the high road. Of course, it would be a different story if the <laughs> Cliff Roses were still all hostile, but thankfully. Someone decided to patch that out, and, and that's, that was a very good idea. Freaking cliff racers. We haven't killed a single cliff racer yet. Maybe... Maybe we won't. I'm just good at using the hover spell for now, rather than the uh, item that we have, because it's only one magicka per cast. Alright, well, we're on a, the top of a very tall mountain here. And we can see absolutely nothing, which is a shame because, you know, it would be nice to have like a good view for a screenshot, but never mind. Fuck. Now, I'm not going to look at the map, I'm just going to keep going. Hopefully, we'll run across uh, this um, <laughs> ruin sooner rather than late. What the hell is that? Oh, what is this? I don't know what this is. I have no idea what this is. I can hear something purring. What is this? Wow. This is the birthplace of Amalexia. I have never seen this before. And I don't think it's modded in. I just have a, it's too simple to be modded in. I just think this is uh why would you be born here? <laughs> um I've never seen it before. I've never seen it before ever. Wow. That's so cool. Suddenly there's nothing there, but it's really cool. Alright, these look like I'm gonna say paths, but they're not really you know man made, are they? They're just Created by the uh, relief a little bit. Let's go up here. That's not the shrine of Amalexia, although maybe Carriage might think that it is, but. Because, <laughs> you know, he'd be forgiven for that, wouldn't you? If you had never seen this shrine of Amalexia before. Oh, hello! Okay. So. Of course, we have to ascertain whether this is the right one. I mean, how many can there be, of course, but... We cannot pass this up. <laughs> we are going to go down there and have a look. Shrouded in mist and mystery. On the coast, south of the old. Why did it say old? They're all old. Doing ruins of, but we can assume is is this place here. Um, 
Thing is, if I go down there and check, like, how the hell would you know there's hardly be signposts, would there? But still, let's let's go and have a look. It's there's a path up to it and everything. Ugh. Yeah, it was a door there, so. <clears throat> Let's go and see whether this is the correct one. It certainly looks like it. It is quite substantial. Rather a large ruin. The thing is, now that we're here. <laughs> oh, would Karish. Yes, he would. <clears throat> Just thinking whether, whether he would um, venture in his, his, his own uh, priorities, you know, rather than do the Talibani thing, and he probably would, because who's going to know, right? If we're late, we're late, and the guy's dead, but no one's going to know we're going to be in here, so this is the right place. One of those things. Uh... I don't know if this is a good idea, Karish. We need to do the healing, the, the, the poison. Oh, wait, we don't have any. We don't have any? We got out that, but yes. Get down there. Get. Okay, there we go. We're not sure about this. Really, you're not sure about doing this dungeon. <clears throat> How many arrows do we have? 29. Not many. Instantly distracted. Alright, it's gonna run out soon. Get it ready again. Oh! You know what? I just assumed. Nice! Okay, we got that at least. Um, let's try and find another one pretty quick. Karish gonna uh body dead 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 Squishy can attack it. There's a lower level there. Oh no. Uh Probably gonna take all my magic and everything to get through this dungeon, that's the only thing. Well they can be quite short though, can't they? Really, really He would. He just would. Karish just just would. He just he'd just do this. He wants to know what's what's in here. Maybe it's a friendly uh ghost. Doesn't seem to be attacking us. Um. Not friendly, is it? Oh, cool. Magic back. Sweet. I don't know if we can soul trap that. I don't know if we can kill it in 60 seconds either. I don't think he hurts it. There could only be one spectre in here. Now we do have a couple of things to help here, don't we? <clears throat> Why is it not working? Why is it not working? Maybe it just did work. Uh, what was the other thing? I'm sure we got something else. Maybe I got rid of it. Frost damage, fire damage. Uh, fire damage would work. Frost damage wouldn't. Yeah, I've only got the one then. Hmm. That does hurt it. Oh, it hurts me as well. Yeah, that hurts me. Um, well. Depends whether it reflects it or not. That reflect is really annoying. 
We've been fought back here. I don't like it. Don't even have to do this. Come on, Karish. That as well. Should do this one first. Come on, Karish. Hit it once. Hit it once. Come on. Come on. You can do this. You can do this. Ugh. Um. Magic cheap. We still strength. We still health mode. Oh. We've got no magic left. Yeah, we're running out of these already. We shouldn't have come in here. Carries his fault, not mine. Okay. Uh, brilliant. I guess. God damn it! I want to press that. I want to do that. Waste of magic here. Get rid of all these. Not those. Because they're way a bit anyway, so. Oh no! No, I don't think so. <clears throat> I think we're going to have to call it quits here. We'll have to come back later. Um, <laughs> Cover my back, Bonnie. We're off. I'm having that. <laughs> But yeah, two more. I think Karish is just going to have to uh, exit this uh, lower level as well. And all around here. Yeah. We're just going to have to go, I'm afraid. We'll come back here at some other time. For now, we'll leave it. Wow. Where's my amulet? I need the amulet. Okay, feel better now. Uh, to the south. Which is this way, because I can see it from the mini map. I don't know how Garish would know that, because normally you'd do it by the direction of the sun and everything. And uh, that would just be like common knowledge. Oh, there's the sun over there. So we can assume that Garish knows which way south is, which is this way. Because we, what we can't assume is, what, is that Garish knows what the hell we're looking for here. I may well go back there if we have enough magicka after this quest, which is unlikely, I have to admit, but still. So what we're looking for now, really, is... Ah! Please kill that. Don't touch me! Ugh, don't stop it, stop it, stop it. Stop it. Oh, stop it. I bet that's blighted that one or something. I'm gonna have my cure just well have it after the fight, it makes sense, isn't it? But we did get this, this conjuration 50, which means that we can now do the proper quest thing for... Come on. Squishy. Um, House of Arnie and start getting our stronghold. Ah! Stop attacking me! Okay. Stop attacking me! Wow. Ugh. Was blighted. Um, we don't even have it. But <laughs> okay, does that give us an extra cool thing? No, nope, it's just blighted rat. 
So now we, we go down here until we find either something that looks like a mage's tower. Or the coast. Sadly, it's really, really foggy. Alright, well here's the coast. So that's that's good. You know, that's what Carriage would have expected. He's found the coast. Now we just need to find a mage's tower. Here. Get away from me. You eyeball me. Is that alive? It is. Um, yeah, just looking for... Yep, yep, I thought so. Get the thing there! That thing there! Get the... Did I cast it? I think I cast it. Oh! Oh! Nice. Uh, and that is... Yep, yeah, that cool. That doesn't look like... The Mage's Tower to me. Things are clearing up a little bit. That doesn't look like a Mage's Tower either. I mean, that's more like Mar, isn't it? We haven't seen that yet. Okay, so purely following the directions, I am lost. There's the... This is south. This... Ooh. Ooh, maybe it wasn't the same one. I just kind of assumed it was. There's another one over there. So maybe. Oh, I now I want to go and visit over there, though. But no, no, no. We got to, we got to keep. Well, it is getting dark, and that looks like a Vivek kind of canton. Well, it is a Vivek canton. Or maybe we could go there and rest. There is a boat there as well, so that definitely means that it's. Uh... You know, there's, there's civilization there. It's connected to the outside world. Let's use the amulet. Yeah, maybe that wasn't it. Maybe it was over there. Maybe there's two glimmer ruins. And Karish just assumed, as I just assume, that... Uh, it, was, uh, it was the right one. But no, maybe the uh, the mage's tower is further over that way. If that's the case, why don't you just send us here and then say, right, well, it's it's, it's east, it's just that way, it's over there. Hmm. But we are just kind of assuming that this is. Uh, and it is, obviously, but you know, this is like a civilized place with its connection with the boat and everything. Ooh, okay, we'll do one more. Someone's asking why I use levitation over water when you can water walk, and it's because you still have to step on the water to water walk. And, ew. <laughs> Hello? Okay, you're not attacking me, good. These are the docks of Molagma, Outlander, and I am. Rindral Drellor, shipmaster of the, of the Molagma. Oh, Molagma, what's your destination? If you like, I can tell you about the local services. What's Molagma? Molagma Stronghold is a combination frontier garrison and pilgrimage, pilgrimage hostel, jointly staffed and maintained by Tribunal Temple and House Redoran. Both the Temple and House Redoran have garrisons of elite volunteers here who defend the stronghold. Pilgrims use the stronghold as a base from which they can attempt. Uh, the difficult and dangerous pilgrimage to the Mount Cannes and Mount Asanibibi, sites north of the Molag Amur wastelands. Is that where we are now? Molag Amur is the rocky, uninhabited wilderness interior of the southeastern Varnfell, where we've just really been. Molag Ma is the only settlement, and it's more of a fortress than a village. Pilgrims come here to visit Mount Cannes and Mount Asanibibi. 
but they can't travel without well equipped heavily armed escorts. There are no paths and ravines, ridges and lava pools make it impossible to travel straight over land. If you get in trouble, you're on your own. Well, unless you can levitate, of course. Why walk when you can fly? Um, so where do you go to? My ship the Whistler can carry to, from Molygmar to Laulad, Vivek, and Tel Branora. And that's what we want to see. Well, we know of Vivek as well. Don't know where this is. Uh, might have been here, I can't remember. But, um... Yeah, here and here we know. So, if we use this as a base for this mission, we'll look at services as well. Uh, we could, you know, then go over there, maybe come back here, and then travel by a boat. <clears throat> if we needed to, we could always just recall. But Okay, the Nord is our local independent smith. Vesasius uh, Vitilius is a trader, a slaver, a trader. Temple Faithful will find a monk, healer, and apothecary in Molygmar Temple. Red Orin, Tinnis, and Kin have their own smith. Doom as a trader and servant with Red Orin Garrison. Nothing about a um, an inn, but we can assume that there's an inn, because, I mean, pilgrims come here, right? They'll need a place to sleep and everything, and that's what we're here for. How much gold have we got? Okay, we have enough to... Uh, do that. Yep, this is just like a Vivek Canton. Complete with ordinators. So what's up here? There's a smith. I don't think we have anything at all for this dude. The only weapon we have is a silver dagger, and we're using that to cut uh, purses and everything. And now we have a stronghold. Is that an inn? It doesn't look like it. Oh, hello. Ooh, nice outfit. Uh, can I be able to look for someone in particular? And we get the same kind of thing, don't we? Now, I'm looking, actually, honestly, for a bed. Maybe there's one across the road. Pretty sure you can sleep here. Pretty sure. <laughs> I always found Molagmar to be one of the most boring, drab, pointless places in vanilla Morrowind. Oh, okay. Maybe there isn't one here then, which would really surprise me. As the canal works there. Nothing down here. Hi, Dralis. Go about your business when I'm watching you. Yeah, usual. Maybe there's something in the canal works. Maybe there's something on the plaza. Don't normally come here because it's really boring. But maybe the uh, mods add something or something. Doesn't look like it, though. Doesn't look like there's much here at all. I always wonder where, where I was, what I came from. You find it a lot in games. Um, just water coming from nowhere. There's an example in Skyrim. At uh, uh, the, the main city you get to, there's a waterfall running. And it looks cool, but the water is not coming from anywhere. Same as this. Where's it coming from? There's a lot of water there. And uh, where's it coming from? You know. Oh, hello. The Pilgrim's Rest. Brilliant. Just well, I'm sure there was one. No, did you? Uh, hello. No beds, obviously. Greetings, Karish. I am Selk Irenimus. Everyone here at the Molygma is involved in the temple outpost of pilgrimage in some way. Is there a specific place nearby you'd like to visit? No, I want to visit you. Um, so we'll we'll rest here regardless. Ten gold is the standard. There you go. And uh, we'll just eat and have a chat with some people. Have a cookie, and these eggs, a muffin, lots of salt rice as well. Start using that and have a word with you. Usual kind of thing. No little advice. Let's have a look at that. Watch out for small camps of outcast Auslanders. 
They prey on careless pilgrims. There's a large outlander, out Ashlander camp beyond Mount Kant and Mount Asani Bibi to the north. Um, Irab, Ira Ben Benim Musum camp. Uh, they're not very hospitable, but they, but we're more or less at peace with them at the moment. So don't rile them. I'm not going to go that way anyway. Thanks. All right, and we'll rest. We'll, well, we'll, we'll wait. Makes no difference. And then we'll uh, we'll leave. There doesn't seem to be a shrine here, which is a shame. Unless there's one at the top uh, on the plaza, which we might have a little look at, and then we'll resume our journey because we do have enough um, magicka to. You know, restore our. We do have enough gold to restore our magic, or even. Um, and I say 25 gold's worth it. It's just whether we can find one. There's a hostel there, but I don't think. Oh, this maybe this is where you stay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So I should have stayed here. What well, doesn't matter? We weren't going to level up, were we? No. Um, so. It's, it's, it's fine. But it's okay. So that's where we should have rested. But no, it's okay. Is this a temple? Oh, it is. I need a shrine. 35. Oh. Not quite what I had in mind. Um... I'd rather know what I was getting first. You hear Johnny Temple? No, no, no. I was looking for. Um... Well, what do you do? What's your trade? My trade? My trade, my trade, my trade. I'm a monk. A mind and spirit. I'm a student of the hidden mysteries of the unseen world that lies beyond objects and ideas of everyday life. In body, I am a student of the ancient martial arts patterned in the reign of sand fighting styles of elsewhere. Uh, I pursue hand to hand and unarmored self defense because what you don't have, you cannot lose. Yeah, I've heard that before. I think this is the one I need. No, it isn't. God damn it. Okay, never mind then. Well, now we've got two buffs we don't need and 70 gold down the drain that we didn't have to spend. But apart from that, it was, uh, it was worth it. Alright, this way. Towards the rising sun, Karish. It's okay. We'll make our money up with the... Uh... With the money we'll get from this quest, right? Right? Oh. Alright, so there should be a boat below us. Yes, there is. So one... Dwemer Ruin. <clears throat> and I'm not going to check what it was on the map. Or, or, you know, I know it said when I entered it. And I just kind of assumed it was the one we needed. But. Might not be. Um, I can't see like a wizard's tower down that way. Not that I know what a wizard's tower really looks like. To be honest. It could be it could be that. It's very difficult. Because I know it's not. But Karish might assume that. Yeah that's his tower up there. We all know it isn't. I could spend like three hours looking in that. Uh, and fighting my way past Daedra and everything for no reason. So. We've seen. Baladas's tower in Nisus, and I'm just gonna look for one of those because that's a wizard's tower, as far as we know. <laughs> what the hell is this doing for that? I don't think our enchants improved very much at all. I thought you got enchanting for using enchanted items, but I don't think you do. Anyway, we're back with our feet on the ground. Uh, soon. And, uh, you know, so we won't go up that way. We'll go up here and then have a look at that one. Well, not have a look at it, but see if there's one south of that. And we are south of it already, so. Pretty much see if there's a wizard's tower over here.
I mean, it could be, could be there. Gotta get a star tower. It doesn't specifically say it's a tower, though, does it? But that's probably a tomb because it's guided by a skeleton, I think. So yes, we'll we'll leave the skeleton over there. I'm gonna skip over here. Yeah, we could well have got the wrong Dwemer Ruin. Hoops of days are due. So have to make sure this doesn't run out of charge, which it probably has actually. Thinking about it. So uh, let's swoop to hover. Of course, half the fun in Morrowind is finding the place you're trying to get to, as we all know. Morrowind directions, everyone. Right, so maybe that's... The ruin that we seek. Maybe it's down there, somewhere. I think that's it, to be honest with you. I think that's the one I need. Out of character knowledge, but... It's very nice, anyway. Take a few screenshots while we're sort of flying through the air. <laughs> well, it's a clear day. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> oh, what a save! <laughs> oh, wow! Okay. Whew. All right then. <clears throat> yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the right, the right bit. So many drummer ruins down here. How many fortresses did they need? Okay. All right, south of this, which is here, but I'm just gonna try and just get my bearings a little bit. I'm pretty sure we're on this peninsula now, so um, I'm pretty confident we're gonna find it. Pretty confident we're going to find it. Oof. I hope we're going to find it. Oh, there's the Shrine of Azura. We'll have to go and see that. We're just going to have to. Uh oh. So. West of the Shrine of Azura and south of the Dwemer Ruins. Alright, so well, that's definitely the Shrine of Azura, isn't it? I mean, we're only going to be here once, aren't we? How could you get to the Shrine of Azura and not go and see it? I got the quest. <clears throat> um... place you really see very often. Huh. <laughs> look at that. Over there is the uh, mainland. <laughs> very different view. I can't fix that. A giant tarantula just squatted over there. 
Moon and Star. Could at least afford some lighting. Oof. Probably the most notable place we've been so far. Karish is hearing voices, and yeah, suddenly that was really, really quiet. Karish is hearing voices. We're going to ignore that. We're going to ignore that uh, until the time comes. He didn't really appreciate that at all. He thinks it's part of the soul sickness thing of hearing voices and stuff and all the dreams and everything. He doesn't really appreciate that sort of thing going on in his head at all. Um... But maybe if we ever go to Dagenfell, we may just go north to see if there is an island with a wise woman living on it. But we've just been a tourist, really. We didn't. We weren't looking for anything like that. Thanks very much. Um, okay, more exploring, trying to find this bloody thing. So. No. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Um, no, no, not the icky water. Thank you. All right, on the coast, west of the uh, shrine, south of that. It's got to be around here, isn't it? It's got to be. Why are wizards? No. Always so elusive. Not two of them. Not two of them. <laughs> Alright, well you just go down there. Two of them? Yeah, no. One of them is bad enough, but two. Especially when we're so close to our goal, and I really want to save, uh... Magicka for the actual quest that we're trying to do. Took an hour to find it. Well, still haven't found it yet, but I'm, I'm almost certain it's... Just over this this rise here. Is that it? There's something there. I'm pretty sure that's not it, but I've never seen... There it is! There it is, that's what we're looking for. That's it. That's a wizard's tower. There we go. We found it. It's on the coast. It's it's in the right place. Perfect. Okay. Um, it's, it looks like what we'd expect it to look like. So, let's go in. And, um... Yeah, find out what the hell's going on here. Ah, finally! Finally, 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 finally. <laughs> 
<laughs> um, although we did find Molagmire as well. That's not far away. That's only over there somewhere, isn't it? I don't know if we can see it from here. It's just over there. Yeah, there it is. We can just see it in the background. Just there. So, that's useful to know that there is somewhere we can get to. Okay. Deserve that. Uh oh. Ooh, that would divert. Um. Run, run. Wow. Okay. Oof, oof. Um, I don't know what this is, but I don't like it. <laughs> I know I have the uh, this, the the thing that, but it's only twenty five points. Um, twenty five percent. Get rid of these as well. They weigh a bit. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Hi! Oh god! <laughs> no! Ah, uh, it's not as bad as it looks. Um, absorb health is probably going to be a good one against those guys who are alive. And we are going to use that now, I think. Cast it. Okay, let's kill them. Things dead. Whatever it was, it's dead. Guys, guys, thanks. Skeleton lightning mage. Wow. Uh, thanks. Well, we have some bad guys to deal with. I might as well just have all these. Is that everything? Yeah, pretty much. Why did your friend attack me? And you didn't. It makes no sense. I okay, alright, alright. <laughs> oh boy, right. The, the the ghost is good because they can't hurt it. Um It's just not quite very offensive. Ah! Yeah, I gotta get some offense as well, which is you. Yeah, it's a marked difference there, isn't there? Maybe not. <laughs> ah, well, battle of the noobs, everybody. So we can assume these are the Lalu people. Nice. Okay, guys, if you let me pass, there's another one to kill. No. Bony! Got the way! Oh, come on. Oh, it's breathing in my ear. Oh, let's give it a go with the longbow. It's great. Take 
Right, how do you miss it? It's like right, she's right, right in front of you. You know, like right there, right there. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's go. I get it. Ow! Ah! Stop with the spam, bitch! Get the hell off me! <laughs> Christ! Yeah, sorry about that, but wow, that was really irritating. Oh, hmm. Loots, loots. Come on, body. Uh, squishy, hurry up. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Uh. Uh. Mm, let's explore the rest of the place first. No. Keep pressing the wrong button. Uh. Create a club. Okay. Eggs. Yep. 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 We'll take them. Uh. Nope. Guami, yep, yep, we'll take that. Saves us buying some supplies. It's in someone's house, you know, so... Should be alright. Okay, so... You had nothing on you. Oh, man. Oh, no. Um... <laughs> I don't like these guys. I don't like them one bit. Nope. Ow. Ah. Oof. Right, we'll leave that. Hopefully he's through here. Ooh. I'm taking it. I'm giving myself a break. I'm taking it. Now, hopefully, he's in here. You must be joking. Um. Ah, squishy. You traitor. A Daedra. Our first Daedra. Um, we don't have to know that it's dangerous to see that it's dangerous. Um, I'm hoping that we can do something here. Uh, we can't. <clears throat> Great. Karish is too fat. That's it. That's all we can do. We have run out of Magicka. Well, I do have, uh... But yeah. Yeah, a Daedra. <clears throat> a Daedra. I'm just assuming he's in his tower and he's put all these things here to... Oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay. Uh, where are we? Oh, okay. Um, that was stupid. I should have... I'll tell you what. I might call it here. Um... I don't know. <clears throat> Actually, this might be more efficient, thinking about it. Because they're all together. Yeah, she's getting pummeled to death. Rather than one at a time. Ow! Mine.
Go, guys, go. Three against one. All right, no, we'll, we'll leave it. Because hopefully this will be more efficient magical-wise, and then we can deal with things later on. More better -er -er -er. Good. One more. Now you die. Thank you. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> Probably best just to do you and you. I should deal with you. All right, so. Um, once again, nothing there. Skeleton mage is over there to deal with now. Um, with pretty much a full magicka pool. Oh yeah, and of course the Daedra. <clears throat> what I wouldn't give for a in invisibility. If these guys don't have anything on them, we'll grab this food again because it's mine and I want it. I deserve it. Oh, different food this time. Nothing decent, obviously, you know, but... <laughs> I am this as well. Now, if I could just... Um... Alright, yeah, have I saved it? Save it. Uh... Okay. And I have a feeling <laughs> uh, it might be worth. Okay. Come on, 61% or something. Come on! There we go. It's really irritating. It's more so magica. Telekinesis is. What the hell is it? 13? It's quite a lot. Whoa. Wouldn't mind absorbing one of these. So there's a there's a, a fire one in there in there as well. For good measure. Okay, we're taking him out. Carry something better. No, 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 not this way! Go in there! Get. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Oh, and another one. I think I did it right the first time. Go over there. First time, though, I'm using my summons to distract the them. Mind you, there might be only one left now. something really good in one of these rooms that I can use to help me. I don't know, it's, it's a chance you take, isn't it? It's a skull. Okay. Might be something in here. Shock resistance. <laughs> uh, vintage brandy. Alright, worth it. Yep, worth it. Worth it. Even if we die worth it. Oh, that seems to be like a quest item, because it was named after him. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes. Ancient Dagoth. Isn't that worth like a million gold? Okay, 150. Fine. Nerf that as well, why don't you? Um. Bony? Bony? No, Bony! <laughs> <laughs> okay, at least the skeleton has an axe. Um, not love that anymore. No, 
Oh, squishy. Yay! Um, squishy versus squishy? Go, squishy! Battle of the squishies. Let's see who wins. I think my squishy is superior, I must admit. Yeah, definitely. No doubt. No! Alright, you can't be that. You can't have that much left. Bony. Got a big sword. Use the big sword! Why is that squishy so much better than my squishy? Mind you, they are slow, so. Even slower than Karish. But there's nothing in here anyway. It's absolutely nothing. Troll game is troll. Okay. Where's... Where's Squishy? Still running down there. Okay. <laughs> we'll just avoid him entirely. Now. This bit. Um, yeah, th I don't have any more Magicka game. Uh, so unless you've thrown me like uh, something really awesome. Like Sujihama. Um, I really don't know how I'm going to get past this. I'm going to have to run. Still levitate again. Run. <laughs> get away. Get away. Get away. Get the. Oh, you get. You get. Uh, no, we've got to restore strength. I remember it. I remember we got to restore strength. La bye. Oh wait, this isn't the way, is it? I just need to find the dude. Oh god. <laughs> I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? And now, yeah. Um, something in one of these crates. This is a soul, soul gem. Potion worth some. Fine. No. Um, <clears throat> well. Shall I have a bite to eat? <laughs> a bit of salt rice? Oh, come on. Just, just let me do. What's this? Red lichen. Yeah. Come on, again. I know this is ridiculous. Oh, God. Fine, I'll drop, I'll drop, um... Come on, shoes. There we go. I don't want to go out there. No intention of going in there. Command creature? Oh, God. Um, yeah. Right, I got a plan. Okay, I thought I'd saved in here, never mind. Different plan, go a different way. Oh, hello! You're different. Ow! Ow! <laughs> oh, man. Um, alright, get the the ghost on the go, because might be a little more tanky. Pretty unlikely, actually, I reckon. Oh, man. I'm a friend, goddammit! I'm so, oh, as well. I am so going to kill this guy when I find him. Look! Dude! Hi! Fine, thank you. What can I do for you? Oh, this place. Uh... Is uh, this person dead? Yes, yes, Othril really dead. Yes, she is, excellent. I can go with it with my experiments. Since you helped me with these meddling Kalu, I might be persuaded to share the res results of my research. What research? Scrolls of summoning are, without exception, based on the law of similarity, as you must know. While others use parts of the creature, such as Daedra skin, for summoning Daedra, I've developed new methods based on recovering a uh, a recovered Dwemer machine. My scrolls only have an image of the Daedra, which works almost as well as the Daedra skin or heart, at a fraction of the cost. 
Okay. Oh, it's uh, yes, quite. Why not take a sample of these new scrolls and examine them for yourself? Now, if you'll excuse me, I really must go back to my work. What, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Summon Daedroth. Oh, nice. Lord and Comp. Yup. They're still attacking me, by the way. Right, I might just go, you know. Uh, yeah, I'm off. I'll, I'll see you later. Um, it's been a pleasure and all, but uh, I have to uh, I have to leave. I'll um, I'll drop you a line or something sometime, yeah? I'll just uh, maybe hopefully restore my fatigue a little bit, so you know. Okay, bye! <sighs> Alright, well, we did it! Uh, oh, we got a lot of... N these are nice. These are nice. Uh, summon day drop for two minutes. So that's really nice. And also, we could sell them. Um, there's that as well. Oh, what a session. Uh, well, we... D the end of Sophia's Means, we did it. And I don't think... Oops, I don't think we'll ever go back there. <laughs> but it's like, call you someone's off, dude. Um, just... Crazy. Absolute crazy. Yeah, I'm just going to call it there. Um, we didn't... Well, we got things to sell. I mean, I got this to sell and various other things. Um, we only got 20 gold, which is a shame. But uh, we should be able to restore our magicka and... Um, yeah, there's that as well to sell. So, we got we got a couple of things. So we should be able to restore our magicka and be able to get back up here to turn that quest in. Although, while we're here now, uh, we can try for advancement. And, because uh, we now have the um, conjuration almost 51 now, um, because of that. But yeah, what adventure that was. Yeah, and I was, I was too straight. I actually found that. <laughs> I didn't know that was that. Oh yeah, you can't get there. I just stumbled across it accidentally. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. Uh, yeah, and there's that. So we, we just found something there instead rather than there. And then we found Malagma. So we, we had a nice little... Uh, we did all that this session. That was good. Uh, and then we get to have an hour and stuff as well. But now we know where that is. So that's another space filled in in our uh, knowledge. Um, so Brilliant. Alright then, um, well hope you guys enjoyed that, I am going to go, um, you guys take care, have a good new year, and um, yes, I shall see you uh, when I see you. So, uh, next time we're going to start making our, uh, or be on the road to making our home, our fortress, so uh, our stronghold, which should be a lot of fun. So, until then, thank you very much for watching, and toodaloo.